सूचक आई एम एन एजुकेटर ऑफ के टू ए फ्रॉम रिचॉइस इंटरनेशनल स्कूल किड्स टूडे यू आर गोइंग टू हैव अ न्यू लर्निंग एक्सपीरियंस यू आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट अ न्यू कंसेप्ट स्पेस थ्रू द वीडियो दैट आई एम गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट टू यू इट्स फन राइट टू लर्न इन अव वे सो लेट्स स्टार्ट सो किड्स हाई अप इन द स्काई In daytime we can see clouds and sun. At night time we can see moon and stars, right? But high up in the sky there is something which we can't see with our eyes. It is that far away from us and that something is space. There are so many objects in space. Do you want to see them? Yes, I know you are excited to see which objects can be seen in space. Get ready. In space there are galaxies, comets, asteroids, meteorites and stars. I know you all are thinking what are these? But don't worry, I'm going to tell you one by one about each one of them the first one is galaxy a galaxy is a huge collection of gas dust and billions of stars and their solar systems there are so many galaxies in the universe a galaxy is held together by gravity The name of our galaxy is Milky Way. Now, next we will learn about comets. Comets are lumps of ice, dust and rock that orbit the sun. The typical comet has a core that is few kilometers in diameter. Comets are often called the dirty snowballs of the solar system. As a comet nears the sun its ices will begin to heat up and turn into gases Now we will move on to asteroids Small bodies which are made of rock and metal are called asteroids Asteroids aren't all round like planets they have jagged and irregular shapes Some asteroids are hundreds of miles in diameter but many more are as small as pebbles. Now let's know about meteorites. A meteorite is a small piece of rock or metal that is broken off from a comet or an asteroid. Meteorites can form from asteroids colliding or as debris from comets speeding by the sun when meteorites enter earth's atmosphere at high speed and burn up the fireballs or shooting stars are called meteors when a meteorite survives a trip through the atmosphere and hits the ground it's called meteorite now we will learn about stars a star is a luminous ball of gas mostly hydrogen and helium held together by its own gravity a group of stars forming a recognizable pattern are called constellation the sun is the closest star to the earth so kids we learnt about five objects that can be found in space Let me ask you what we learned in a form of quiz. Are you ready for my questions? My first question is what is our galaxy called? Come on kids, think. I know you will get an idea. The answer is Milky Way. I know you all are also told the correct answer clap for yourself 
My next question is Lumps of ice, dust and rock that orbit the sun are called? Come on, think. I know you will give the correct answer this time also. So, the correct answer is comets. I know you have also said this answer. Clap for yourselves. The next question is, name of the star closest to the earth. Very easy one. I know this is, ev this is going to be everybody's correct answer. The correct answer is, sun. Clap for yourselves. Thank you. Hope you have enjoyed the new learning session of space. Parents, we have attached the links of songs related to space at the end of the video. Kindly play the songs for the kids and you can also enjoy with them. Kids, I wish we can meet soon. Till then, stay home, stay safe. I, Miss Kushbu, signing out on behalf of Rejoice International School. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Activity sheet can be downloaded from the link provided below.